So I've had a lot of you ask me about the rifle setup I'm using. So I want to do a quick video today and just kind of go over my setup, give you guys an idea of what I'm running. So first of all, everything is built around a Christensen Arms NPR chassis. So back here in the back, we've got a full carbon fiber cheek piece, adjustable LOP, adjustable comb, and this thing also folds. Nice, handy, sleek stock, absolutely perfect chassis. So coming down here, I've got my adjustable bag rider. This thing mounts to a little picker L that screws on to the chassis down here. And this thumb wheel raises and lowers the bottom portion of this riser to make your elevation corrections when you're riding on a rear bag. Super handy, super stable. I absolutely love that thing. So coming forward, I've got an XLR Industries grip. So as you can see, and I kind of showed my other video a little bit, this is a big, fat, vertical grip. Kind of great for positioning my hand the way I like to shoot. Um, absolutely love the grip. Coming forward a little bit more is this enormous bolt knob. So this is one I turned out of an old 7mm barrel blank, about an inch in diameter. It is enormous, but when I'm running fast, I don't miss the bolt. So it's kind of handy that way. Um, coming down here, Trigger Tech Diamond Trigger. Set it about a pound, and all that is contained in a Christensen Arms receiver, Christensen Arms bolt, Christensen Arms scope rail. Uh, the majority of the hardware is Christensen Arms, obviously. So coming up to the optic, I've got the Tacticam FTS that's mounted up here <clears throat> to the back of my Leupold Mark V. So as you've seen in the other videos, this is an awesome scope, incredibly clear. Um, I am absolutely in love with this thing and the way I can film with the Tacticam through it. Awesome setup. So coming forward a little bit more, um, full carbon fiber handguard. I've got some Arca accessory rails in the bottom with a bipod on a pick rail in the front. This is just a cheap, like $25 Amazon bipod. That is my next upgrade. So coming forward, I have got a 26 inch 6mm Creedmoor barrel. Um, just a heavy steel contour made from a Christian Snarf blank. And on the end is a muzzle brake that I kind of just drew up and had one of my friends do the machining work for me. So here's my rifle. All in about 18 pounds. But for doing some positional and PRS style shooting, this thing has been absolutely amazing. And in case you guys didn't know, there is the 6mm Creedmoor bullet that it shoots. Thanks.